In today's video, man, we are going to be counting all of these dumb. Oh my, oh my, oh my god in heaven. We're gonna be we're gonna be counting all these figure belts, I guess. All right, man, so here is all of the championship belts, man. This is every single one outside of a few, all right? We, we don't include every single one. I do have a couple on display, not like an ish ton, but there are a few on display here. But today, we're going through my entire WWE Action Figure Championship belt collection. Now, there's got to be hundreds here, but today, we're going to find out how many this is, and I will count the ones on display. You know what? I'll try my best to narrow it down. I think there's like 10 on display maybe somewhere in the room, but I'm pretty sure this is the rest of them. I got to double check. Uh, we'll triple check. We'll make sure but what I got to do first is I got to separate every single championship into its own individual pile and then we'll go through each individual championship talk about it why I have so many of them maybe and just kind of collect them all and just see how big this collection truly is because we haven't done this video in a while I did this video maybe two years ago maybe maybe three years ago man it's been a long time but let's buckle the hell up shut the hell up and I'll see you guys after I organize all these R.I.P. While we're waiting on myself to count the championships, huge shout out to our patrons of the MDT YouTube channel, man. And a huge shout out to HMB Little Man for subscribing yesterday. Huge shout out to you, bro. Thank you for joining the Patreon. If you guys are interested in becoming a patron of the MDT channel, link in the description below. Lots of bonus content and perks over there for you. But now, let's get back to my DA counting those championships. A few moments later. Bullshit! Alright guys, so that took a hell of a lot of time, man. I did not expect that to take so long. I think that took me three hours. Now, given I was taking my time, I wasn't like shifting through it like, like Spongebob when he forgot his name, but it took a hell of a lot of time. Anyways, I wrote down all of the totals of these championships, and we're gonna go through here, and I'm gonna let you guys know, so I don't remember what the most was. I think the most was the big gold right here, and that is this massive pile here, and it doesn't really look like it, but that is 34 big gold championships. And a lot of people always ask me why I have so many of those. I've told the story multiple times, but first of all, the Ultimate Edition Target Exclusive Batista, I bought a lot of that figure that came with the big gold, but also way back in the day on this old like Chinese website, they had big gold championships for like 37 cents or something like that, or maybe a dollar or maybe, I want to say it was like 38 cents or something like that. And I bought 20 of them or something like that. And so I've just always had a big storage of those. We have my custom championships over here counting. And I also took into account all of the championships championships on display on my wall. So I was including all of these right here on my Vindication and Roster shelves. I was including all these down here on the MDT shelves and all of these different things. I included them all, man. I included them all. There's a couple up here from the John Cena shelf. Like, I, I went through. I did all my homework, man. So coming back to the floor right here is our Spinner Championships. I almost forgot about these. They were in my John Cena drawer in this little bag right here. And I had them with a lot of U.S. championships as well. But at the end of the day, we did have 24 of those. We we have custom championships right here, and including all the ones on display, we do have 31 of those. Down here, I mean, the TNT, you got two of these, like five of the black version with the gold. You got one of the red and silver. Could have swore I had like 98 of those. Only have one. That kind of blew my mind. One of the Owen Hart ringside exclusive, and then we have the three different versions of the AEW Women's Championships. We had the medium version, which I had one of, two of the small, and two of the large. Over here, we had a Jax US Spinner Belt. I like it more than the Mattel. I sold all my Mattel US Spinners because they're way too small. They don't accurately display the U.S. spinner. So I have two of those for the John Cena collection. We have 12 of the Red Universal Championship. Coming back down here to the AEW, we have eight AEW Tag Team Championships and nine AEW World Championships. Thought I would have way more of those as well. Didn't expect that. Over here, you guys can see we have one of the Cruiserweight Toys R Us exclusive TJP Cruiserweight medals. We have three total Jacks Big Golds because I have one on my John Cena shelf. One Rated R Spinner Championship right here. For the Modern SmackDown title, we have have 10 of those. We have 19 of the Raw. So I don't know. I, I, I'm guessing it's back in the day when we got the Elite 64 Rollins or there's a couple Rollins that came out that had the Raw Tag Team Championship and I bought a lot of those. I guess the SmackDown version is more rare. Moving into the Big Eagle, we have 16 of those. 17 of the Oval IC Championship, which is my personal favorite version of the championship. And if you guys notice, I do have like the blue version of the Big Eagle. You got like a custom red IC title and then I do have the Ringside Exclusive Rock version. And I just went ahead and threw those in there. I could have had, you know, thrown it in there as one of those or vice versa, but I just went ahead and counted them towards the total. For Blue Universal Championships, we had 13. 
15. Coming back over here to the WWF World Tag Titles, we actually had 15 of those. 10 of the Raw Women's Championship, 9 of the White IC title, 6 of the Ruthless Aggression Raw World Tag Titles, and then we had 7 of the SmackDown WWE Tag Team Championships from the Ruthless Aggression era. I don't know why I have less of that. I think that's because I'm actually shocked at that one because I bought a lot of that Legends Kane that came with that World Tag Title, so I don't know what's up with that. Modern Cruiserweight Championships, we had 8 of those. For the Winged Eagle and all of the variants of that, we have 11. We have the white version on display with Hulk Hogan. We have the 2013 WWE Championship, six of those. Four of the Undisputed Championship or the WWE Championship. One Mae Young Trophy, and we actually have five Andre the Giant trophies, but we have three regular, and then we have two custom-made ones. For the old NXT Championship, we have four of those. Five of the new NXT tags. Four of the old NXT tags. Four European Championships. Three North American Championships. Championships, three Ruthless Aggression Cruiserweight Championships, three Penny Belts, which are the worst. I hate those effing belts. Two Silver ECW Championships, four UK Championships, which actually shocked me. Didn't expect that one. We have three, no, wait, four, five. We have five of the SmackDown Women's Championships, if you include the one on display. And then you do have the Naomi Glow in the Dark version. We have two of the Yellow IC, two of the Planets Championship, two of the Modern Intercontinental Championship, three of the NWO right there. One of the versions came, God, what did it come with? Well, I think two of them came with the Ultimate Edition Hollywood Hulk Hogan, and then one of them came with, I, I can't even remember, bro. Maybe it was like a Kevin Nash Elite or something like that. With three of the Million Dollar Championship, three UFC Championships, three Modern Men's NXT titles, two Women's, we have two 24-7 Championships, two Divas Championships, three Hardcore Championships, four Women's Championships, Championships. And then all across the top is all we have one of, and it's just a bunch of variant and random championships. I don't know if I have every single championship that Mattel has made. I want to say I am missing a few off the top of my head. Like the U.S. Mattel Spinner that came with John Cena. Don't have that one. And I also have one modern U.S. championship that is on display with Austin Theory because he is the champion. And then I almost forgot over here, you guys could see all of my different money in the banks. You got like a few briefcases. You got the big versions. I have actually six of these smaller, like more accurate gold money in the bank, you know, briefcases. And then I do have my custom ones from the pick fed. You got the bullet club money in the bank. And then we have the old Jack's money in the banks down here. It's a lot of random, you know, briefcases and things like that. But God in heaven, we haven't done this video in so very long, but now it's time to add up the total. And while I'm talking, man, leave your prediction for how many championship belts you think I have in my collection in its entirety. How many WWE action figure belts, not including mid on card belts, not including anything I have in package. I'm talking about all Lucy's right here, man. Let me know down in the comment section below. Make your predictions as we are about to reveal the total number of figure championships in my collection and the total number of WWE action figure belts or just wrestling action figure belts loose in my collection that I have in total is going to be, I don't even remember, somebody needs to look up, after I reveal the number, somebody go look up the actual total from the other times we did this video and see how it has changed over the years because we haven't done this video in two or three years, I'm pretty sure. However, the total is going to be 431 total championship belts, man. Absolutely ludicrous. Chris. That is absolutely insanity, but you saw it all right here, man. Just just crazy. Crazy number of championships. Need to do like a giveaway for, for a few of the belts. I like do a package deal or something like that. Sometimes I list lots on eBay of package deals. Like I'll put like six titles in a lot and sell them off. But I appreciate you guys so very much for watching. Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below on this one. How many figure belts do you have in your collection? Is yours as asinine and ridiculous as mine? Or maybe you have way less? Or maybe you have a medium amount? I don't know, but somebody help me. I'm getting out of here, man. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at My Damn Toys. I'll see you guys next time. Have a blessed one, and I'll see you in the next video. We'll never